Hello and welcome back to my Minecraft Let's Play series. In this episode we're going to be doing a bit of cave exploring. I got a comment off a, well, a subscriber actually, I actually do have them, uh, by the name of uh, Kevinator213. I uh, hope that's right. If not, sorry. <laughs> I'm going to put a little quote of what he said in one of the top corners. Maybe left or right, I'm not sure. When, I, when I'm editing the video, I'll put it in. What he said, but basically it was I should do some more exploring and show it off underground. So, um, here we are. <laughs> so, uh, for over the next one or t two videos, possibly, uh, depending on how long they go, I'm going to do some exploring. Now, I haven't really done much in this area. Uh, my home is over that way. Ooh, I actually still hit that one, which is quite surprising. Um, it's over in that direction anyway, so I'm going to get some exploring done. And... Let's uh, let's just have a look and see what we find. Now, I'm just going to have a look down this way. I know there's actually a bigger cave system down there. That is, I haven't explored yet, but it's a massive opening. So, first we're going to explore down here. Now, don't worry, I'm going to use plenty of torches. Let's do light up the area. There's a few bats, if you can see. I'm using the latest snapshot. Um, w, uh, 12W40B, I believe. Oh, God. Jeez. Now, they are quite cute. They're, you know, they're really... Oh, better close the door. I don't want to escape in. Uh, these spawn uh, in caves underground um, in dark levels. They are passive, so they won't attack me. And well, they're quite cute. And if you don't disturb them, they will hang upside down. So if I'm further up away, but obviously the bat is running away. Uh, I can kill them, but I don't let them drop anything. So let's just try it. Yeah, they don't drop out. You just kill them and come here. Kill me. Stop. I'm clicking randomly. I'm trying to get the bat. There you go. Let's just light this area up. Now a bit of gravel. Now I do know there's actually uh, a cave over there, so let's sort of dig through, shall we? See what's on the other side. Ah, yes, I know I've just walked past some resources, don't worry, I'll pick them up and just have a little nosy look. Ooh. Let's clear this out. I'm going to put a torch here so I know where I am. And, well, let's go left, right, left, oh, I don't know. There's actually a skeleton above me. And we're not far below ground level, so uh, don't be expecting much, I guess. Oh, there's a skelly there. Some water. Ow. I hate water when you're actually going against it. It's fine when you're not, but let's get this light this up. This looks like a dead end. Let's get up. Human. Uh, right, let's see. Gravel comes to some good use. Locking up water. Sources. Now, I'm going to mine some coal. Yeah, it was a nice comment. I thought, um, it were a good suggestion, so I thought, well, might as well actually go do it, might I? You know, keep your, your few subscribers I have happy. <laughs> I don't want to upset them and make them uninscribed, so... Yeah. Let's see where this goes. Now, the latest snapshot that I'm running on, uh, not really added much. Uh, it's done a few bug fixes. Uh, added witch... witch um, huts apparently to the swamps, I haven't seen them yet, and also it has added uh, s now slime spawning swamps biomes um, at night, so that's kind of, that's going to be quite cool, so you now you don't have to look around randomly and hopefully bump into a slime, you can actually find them in the swamp biome, you just got to find them, especially with me on live biomes, I've, I don't, I don't really know if any is close by, so that's a bit of a problem for me, but hey, We'll find out. Now, I have got plenty of sticks with me and charcoal and torches, but uh, well, that was a bit of a, a short run there. Now, huh, well, that's a short cave system, but don't worry, this was just a little one compared to the one hopefully I'm going to go into. It seemed a lot bigger anyway when I was looking at it, so let's head back out. Otherwise, this would be a really short episode. Uh, let's dig some of these, get some XP while I'm at it. Oop. The good thing about lighting up this area though is that the fact of if I want to make like a, a mob grinder or, a, um, or an XP grinder or whatever you want to call it, it's really just to get mob materials off mobs, uh, it makes them spawn more on the surface if you start lighting up the area underground, which is kind of cool. Uh, and quite handy later on. Oh, uh, it's raining. I don't know if you can hear that. I can't. Quite loudly. I'm probably going to have to turn my sound down because it rain can be quite loud and annoying. I found that quite useful. Yeah. Well, find that out quite a lot, to be honest, when uh, recording in the rain. It's a lot louder than you think. Oh, actually, have you noticed, uh, one thing I've noticed about in this snapshot is 
I remember in the old Minecraft when you had um, these drops, just put one on the floor, they actually all combine together now if they're all in one block. So if I throw them like that, and just flow loads. Oh, I didn't do it that time, that was kind of weird. If I do that, and the throw them on one block, if you notice, they're all disappearing. If I keep doing that, you'll notice there's two, and then there's three. So you'll notice there's only three actual there, but if I pick that up like that, it's 26. 27, 28. So which is quite interesting. It's, the, it's weird how it works out now. It seems like all the, I think they're called sprites, uh, all like linked together in one. So if you have, it's like, it's why sometimes I thought when I've killed an animal I've only got the one drop. And it's actually like, picked up a load more. So again, uh, again, do that. Just chuck load down. I think, oh, there's not that many there. Oh, actually no. I think it's if you chuck load at once, it actually, you know, if you do that, it actually won't do it. It does. Oh, weird. It's, it's random, it's very random. It doesn't seem like it, it works sometimes, but then it's like lag, it just puts it on here right now. It's afraid it. I do actually want to get straight into down here. Now, this is what I want about. Now, I'm going to head straight down as quick as possible. I'm just going to take damage as I go, because I want to get out of the rain. Now, this is actually a cool cave system, by the looks of it. Turn down my sound a bit more because it is annoying. Rain, I don't like rain. <laughs> use as much torch as I can to light up the area. Hello, is this Skelly? Are you waiting for me? <laughs> well, too late, you're dead now. Uh, a little bit of a hole there, but I'm not going to go through. So, yeah, uh, back to usual, I guess, in my Let's Play series now. Uh, after a while I've been not making many videos, so this is back to normal. Well, hopefully anyway, nothing might pop up. I am up out in a bit, so I'm going to try and do a little quick video. I'm probably going to split this into two, even if I end this one here. Oh, hello, Mr. Bat. Even though you are nice and cute, I'm going to kill you. That rain is still doing my head in, so I'm going to turn it down. That's quite enough. Okay, I'm going to say, have I been here before? Even though I'm not that deep underground, it's uh, very extensive, this cave system. Now, let's have a look. I think I'm just going to really mine iron in any particular order. I've got loads of coal already. Ooh, that goes all the way down by the looks of it. Let's take that root down there. So, as you see, I'm putting torches on the right hand side so I don't get lost because it's quite easy in this uh, little system of caves to get quite lost easily, so put that torch there. Let's have a look, there's some more iron. Let's see what we can find. More iron. Lava. Hmm, I'm just going to follow the massive cave, you know, it seems like it told a lot more fun. Uh, maybe find some diamonds, that'd be cool. Uh, you can never have too many diamonds. Nice shiny objects. Oh. Whoa! Damn Enderman. Now, normally they make a weird sound, but it seems like having this time. It's a really freaky sound when you've uh, first startled them, but it doesn't seem like they've got it. Uh, let's have a look. Find some more of you, iron. You can never have too much of you. Seems I'll go through that much. Surprisingly enough, and it's more or less all in uh, swords. Now, put a torch there because I know that leads straight back to where I've just come from. Uh, more iron there. Let's make some more. Use the charcoal. Oh, oops, too many torches. <laughs> well, I guess you can't have too many. That's more than I wanted to make. So that's the end of that road. Um, yeah, if, if you don't know how to make charcoal, charcoal is just basically putting uh, wooden logs into a furnace and cooking them, and you get charcoal. That's if you, you know, you can't find coal, but coal's that abundant, I'd be surprised if you can't find any. You could say if you're lazy and you don't want to go underground, you could say. So, there's, there's coal everywhere, yeah. no matter if you can find, it's, yeah, not surprising. Now, we're it down this way? Yeah. Follow the hole down. Ow see where we can go. Oh, uh, is that a creeper or a zombie? 
Hello? Hello? Nothing creepy as you can't hear, so... <gasps> oh, it's a creeper. I can see you. Get it before you blow up. Ooh! What's down here? Oh, is that another creeper? Hello, Mr. Creeper. Don't blow me up. Go away. Let you die. So I want to block that lava up actually, because I want to go down that way at some point. So I'll put you there. Let that uh, disappear for a bit. Head this way. See what we got. So this goes back up. So it's probably not the best way to go, but uh, well, I might as well explore. You never know what you can find up here. Do 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 do. And it goes back down again. And to a dead end. Yeah. <sighs> what a surprise. I do wish there were more kind of stuff in Minecraft which you could find underground. Uh, maybe some more dungeons, some different kinds of dungeons, not just the regular weird bit of spawner, but so you could actually explore. Um, maybe some more buildings on the surface you could come across and find. I know they're adding quite a lot now in Minecraft. Uh, Jeb and that are doing a magnificent job, uh, but it seems like it's still a bit bare. Uh, it gets quite repetitive quite quickly. Now, oh, I need to get down there. Are you taking the time getting rid of? Well, I'm going to do it for you. Oh, oh, that went down quite quickly. Which I could use that as a natural light, I think. You just go into there? Yeah. Now, you don't spread any further. That's probably actually a not the best idea, but we could do it like that. So, at least it isn't like a natural light, so I'd have to use the modern torch. So, flood of water. Coming down, and that is that obsidian there. Let's have a look around. See what we can find. Redstone, so that means we are quite deep down now. Uh, oh, hello, Mr. Zombie. Oh, there's no one there. Oh, no, it's a villager. A zombie villager. It's kind of cool now. I like the variety of that. You actually can get zombie villagers now. Ooh, and I'm actually getting really hungry. That's not good. Eat, eat, eat. Regen my health. Uh, let's have a look. Put some more torches out. See what we can find. So there's redstone, plenty of it around. Uh, what layer are we on? Oh, we're on 12. That means diamond layer. Oh, sweet. Hopefully, <laughs> that is. Uh, oh wow, there's plenty of bats everywhere though. Got some redstone, even though I've got plenty of this, but you get quite a bit of XP from mining redstone, so it's worthwhile. And there's that much of it to mine, you get a lot of XP, so get it while it's hot. Oh, lapis, and that's another resource which is basically useless in this game, but you get XP from it for mining, so. Again, mine it. <gasps> Diamonds! Yes! Sweet. So, like, oh, I guess the guy's comment was actually do some exploring, you might find some. Diamonds! Oh, just the, just the one. Oh, well, better than none. Plenty of lapis. Useless lazuli. So we've got a nice haul so far. Do do do. Do do do. Oh. Come on, let me up. Oh. Let's hope I don't get lost, because that would really suck. Having all this stuff and then getting lost. Even though I know which way up is, it's just the fact of trying to find out where you are. Because if you come out, just dig up randomly in a different place where you're not used to, you can get lost. So, oh, there's gold there. Let's have a look. Oh, and another thing, the lighting engine that I was explaining in the last video or it before has been reverted back to the old one again. Uh, I think there were a few bugs that popped up apparently in the engine and they needed a bit more work. So, they reverted it. Uh, I kind of liked it. But hey, if something's not finished, no point releasing it. Even though we're in the snapshot, but if, it, if it's not going to be ready in time for the main release, then don't put it in. 
Otherwise, you're gonna have a lot of people complaining. Because people just complain about oat these days. Uh, which I find out quite a lot of, including myself. I complain. <laughs> but hey, if you're a paying customer, I guess you want to uh, get the full.